To record CAN bus in LMS Test Lab, go to the Channel Setup page and select in the upper right the CAN Settings menu. There you can select the DBC file that contains the information about the particular vehicle and powertrain that you're using. You can set the baud rate, usually 500,000. You'd also pick the device that you're using. This would be, for example, if you have a CAN card in your Scatus Mobile or if you're using Access built-in CAN. And then you can view the CAN channels in the overview here. By default, in a CAN bus file, you'll find many, many channels. In this case, this particular file has over a thousand channels. If I was interested in just the engine RPM, I could type in RPM and then do a search for just the RPM channels. Then I would select the engine RPM channel. I'd hit apply and now I have this channel active. If I go back to channel setup, you see it here. I'm also going to save the raw CAN files if there's other CAN channels I want to decode later. Instead of using the default name, which is a bit long, I can come in and say something like CAN Engine RPM. And once you have your CAN channel set up, you can go to the measure worksheet to view it. Here, I can open the Data Explorer and I can drop in the CAN channels that I want to see. For example, I can look at the CAN channel in RPM and I can also look at it versus time. I can also look at my data channels at the same time. So my CAN channels and analog channels will be recorded together. And now I can turn on my car. And you can see the engine RPM updating. And as I press the gas, you can see the RPM changes. And that is how you record CAN channels plus analog channels all in one acquisition. Thank you.